I don't really know anything about Atkinson's, but I've been incredibly interested to try out the brand. I've really been loving niche fragrances at the moment, particularly perfumes to Mali. So when I saw that this was a chance to be able to review all of the fragrances, I had to get my hands on it. What I'm probably going to be doing with this is also sharing it with my boyfriend to see what sort of fragrances he likes as well. And I'm really interested to learn more about Atkinson's in general and seeing which fragrances really spark my interest and which ones I'm really going to want to buy the bigger bottles of. Love to back a British company. Company. I'm going for mint and tonic. Let's see what happens. <laughs> that's lovely. 100% smells like a gin and tonic. <laughs> yeah, that's really nice. It's like chucking a gin and tonic on your wrists. I was already excited, but now I'm even more excited to see what other scents there are in this because they seem pretty true to their name. This is my baba. 44 Gerard Street, I actually have got. I heard that they were doing a nude collection with this one. Who would save the queen and the king. Atkinson is just one of those top brands that if they do a fragrance, you know it's going to be good. So I think it's going to be interesting to try all these different types. I looked it up on the internet afterwards and it gave you all the sort of different types that were in this collection. And like I said, when you get to try a nude collection, you've got to go for it. Who is king? I really can't wait for this one. Who doesn't want to try a discovery set, especially when it's got each of their most popular scents from each of their collections. Atkinson's, for those who don't know, are actually a British niche perfume brand, which we love to support Essential. There's some incredible stories around these fragrances. This The bottles are so regal. So when I saw there's a discovery set of all of the best-selling ones, I knew I had to have it. I personally love the Ouds. The Ouds Save the King and Queen have never been something I can actually afford. So now I've got a little samples. Maybe I will convince myself to buy them. What I love is this gives you the best of Atkinson's and they're grouped within their categories as well. So you've got the Ouds, the Eau de Parfums, and you've got like the ones that are typically redolent of London and Britain. So can't wait to try. Already I can tell that this dark brown one is the one I want to try. This was actually in our vanilla box and I never got to smell it. I think it was in the vanilla. Wow, smoky talcum powder, vanilla-y bonfire. Gonna have a lot of fun with these. And um, my sister, if you're watching, they're not for you. I'm really excited about this. I've chosen Atkinson's, which I am so excited to try because it is literally one of my favourite brands for myself and my partner. I wear more of the Oud collection. Currently, I have Oud Save the King and Oud Save the Queen as part of my fragrance collection. So this gift set is perfect because they're not the cheapest fragrance. They're very niche, so I would love them all, but I can't. So this is perfect gift as well. And for me and my partner to try each of the fragrances as well.